All right, I wanted to show you guys one of the accessories that I picked up for metal detecting underwater. And I picked this up probably after my second or third time underwater with the, the Blue Nomad. Is these, what, these are what you call BCDs in scuba, only it's a lot bigger. A lot of them have pouches for your weight belt. I have a, a couple of them, one for me and one for my wife. But, I mean, traveling around, I can fold these up, and I'll explain what they are. I can fold them up, put them in the same case with the Nomad and, and travel around. So what these are, these are snorkeling flotation devices. And with practice, if you practice in, say, a pool or a lake or the ocean where you're still able to stand, you can even inflate these underwater. Just like they teach you in open water class for paddy, they show you how to inflate your BCD underwater if you run out of oxygen in your tank so you're able to float to the surface. So what I noticed about metal detecting underwater, for me anyway, I use 10 pounds of weight in my weight belt. I like to be planted on the bottom and move around slowly, metal detecting. Uh, if I want to be neutrally buoyant, neutrally buoyant is where you breathe in, you come up a little, when you breathe out, you go down a little. If I want that, I go with seven pounds of weight, six to seven. I've been metal detecting the last few weeks with 10 pounds of weight with, with these. Um, my first dive with this one was two weeks ago, and then I got the Scuba Pro. I needed two anyway, one for me, one for my wife, so I went with the Scuba Pro. And I really like both of them. Um, both of them fold up. I like this one a little better because it has a zipper and, and the back is, is really nice as well. And this, you know, both of them have the same type of material, very comfortable to wear. This one clips in and has some Velcro. What, what these are, they're flotation, flotation support. So if you're metal detecting in a lake with the Nomad, you can go down 30 feet. If you're traveling out, you're metal detecting. Um, and you want to end your dive and your hunt you're able to f come to the surface and inflate this you just blow in both of them the same you blow in and then you let out so when you let out it locks within a i'd say a breath you're you're floating on the top a nice long breath and, and you're floating that also helps if you're down and you realize you have a little too much weight you can add just a little air in here and become neutrally buoyant and you can hover along the bottom and and still metal detect so I noticed without it, when I was 10 pounds, first you got to make sure you can get back to where you're standing and then walk out of the water. Um, but with these, I'm able to come up even at 20 feet, 30 feet, whatever you're down, inflate this and swim nicely along your back to where you can then stand to wherever your exit point is. So, you know, planning your dive and executing your dive these are really good just like a scuba bcd how you want to inflate that and float comfortably and get back to the water uh get back to the shore you can do that with these i'll put a link for both of them this is an amazon special um you know when you put in i don't even know what you put in but i'll put the link i found this one on amazon i think this is around 60 dollars. this is a little over hundred i'll post i'll post both links but i think if you're a metal detectorist who metal detects underwater they're both great to have it's one less thing to worry about you know with just one breath you can float to the top the reason i have the blue nomad out is just to kind of show how i put these on so this i put to talk about how i put them on this one's still soaked from yesterday um i put this on first and then i put this over and even with it being snug on you so this pulls on your back um you just still a breath, full breath and you're floating on the top so it the chambers still inflate and you're able to you know exit out with this on first it really doesn't have a great place to go with this being on your back and this being on your back as well so yeah i figured i'd share that information i'll put the links to them if you want to check them out thanks for watching